uh, ghostwriting is, is, is something that people really need to consider as a songwriter too. Sometimes you can write those songs and you know. Hello guys, welcome back to Life Updates with T. Thank you so much for tuning in and thank you so much for joining me. If you are new here, we are the winning family, the moving train. So if you would like to become a member of our family, you can just simply hit the subscribe button and also don't forget to turn on the notification bell so you know whenever we get to post a new video. So guys, I am back with another update. Mm, you know what today vino was kind of like um um having sharing his knowledge in terms of songwriting at a youtube black event which was happening today and apparently a lot um he actually said a lot about uh, songwriting and all that stuff and it appears that alleg allegedly sorry <laughs> allegedly he's been writing songs for a lot of artists like he calls like they call him a ghost writer so basically he writes the song he maybe he writes the songs and then he sells them you know to the to the artists or to the people who are supposed to be singing the song and all of that apparently most of the songs that we have been dancing to are written by him like it's so crazy right it's so crazy i just want to find out which songs are this like which songs did he write apparently he wrote like a lot of them and we've been dancing to most of the songs that were written about vinyl but anyways um all i can say is that he is a talented man after all i think he is actually a talented man i mean only a talented man would do that you know only a talent like only a talented man would sell i mean um uh, lyrics and stuff like that so yeah he is actually a very talented man now let's move on to the next topic Terry Treasure is a spoiled hun, okay? And the way she's looking good, the skin, she looks amazing. She's a spoiled hun. So, like, she posted on uh, her, her stories on Instagram um, while she was, you know, traveling. They actually took them to a trip in uh, Northwest. I'm not sure about where this place is located. Um exactly i'm not really familiar with uh northwest so obviously i, I wouldn't know but uh, it seems like there's something going on there because she's not the only one who actually went there and uh, the trip seems to be like seem to be very nice because like everybody's just there and they seem to be connecting and this is what she said on her instagram on on her instagram page she said day one of three got the opportunity to be touring northwest with a few of the coolest people Te i mean um i was about to say temba no <laughs> mbalingosi is one of the mbalingosi is one of the big brother ex housemates from i think it's season two if not season one i don't even remember properly and then the others i think they're just like uh instagram influencers and i think they're somehow shooting something you know like from the way i'm seeing it because there's cameramen all over and it seems like something is going on i cannot wait for now for uh, the announcement like what's really going on what are they shooting is it a project of some sort or is it a real reality show what is it you know i would like really love to 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 watch this if it is like some sort of a reality show or something but yeah i'm really proud of her i mean guys you all know we're all about supporting over here we're all about uplifting so whatever small or big you know achievement or move it's it's a great move definitely so I, I was just you know happy to see her with the the other ladies and the guy over there you know doing what they were doing and i was just like i cannot wait for more content you know and stuff like that and also let's move on to the last topic for tonight um oh my god i don't even know why i've been not talking about this i don't know like how did it slip my mind but yeah i don't really blame myself because with me i always forget i you know i tell myself that i want to be talking about certain things and stuff like that and i just end up forgetting just like that i guess i it just slipped my mind i actually wanted to talk about it but yeah so um poor Abadimo actually made a clip today you know talking about her homecoming that's actually gonna be happening happening this weekend 
on the 21st of May. It's yo guys like i'm even subboiling like i'm even subboiling to be there the way she was explaining everything and i'm like oh my god i just want to find myself there i just want to see myself there because wow it seems like it's really gonna be nice over there you know really gonna be nice you can actually go check out the details on her instagram stories she posted everything there and also she's not the only person who's actually gonna be there other housemates will be definitely joining her i think Ntabi will be there um uh, sister mara temba who else who else okay i don't remember that's what i'm saying that you can do check out the details over there about the location the venue and everything so it's really it's, it seems like that like it's gonna really be it's really gonna go with oh guys it seems like it's really gonna get down over there so please do make sure that if you are in davidson even if you're not in davidson if you are at some way around like the neighborhood even if you're not somewhere close by guys i mean if you want to attend if you're serious about attending just make sure you know you go support the girl over there at davidson i'm sure it's really gonna be a nice event and also I'm really curious because um actually someone asked um Paul a question earlier yes is it yesterday or today? Let me look for the question. Oh actually it was yesterday when she had uh an Instagram poll. Like all of those housemates, all of a sudden all of them are answering questions. What's happening? Okay, but yeah, this is what the person said. Why haven't you met up with Ntabi and Nali? And her response was, um, I was with my girl yesterday. She was obviously referring to Ntabi. And she uh, after that, she said that we don't really always get time to link up like or to meet up all of us. You know, and I was like, does this mean that her and Nali are actually maybe in communication? Or maybe she was just answering to like push time or she just didn't, didn't want to focus on on the other nale part i'm just curious because honestly i would have really loved to see them together guys like honestly i would there would be a really great combination i'm not saying that they should be friends but all i'm saying is that i would actually love to see them together you know like just you know like being cool with each other you know i know most of these people are not friends but at least they talk to each other and they do communicate and all that so i would really love to see that from the both of them so yeah let's just wait and see as time goes by time will definitely tell but for now guys i'll just have to leave you good night i'm not gonna come back with another update so i will see you guys tomorrow i love you bye